I'm Jo and this is my Top 5 Wednesday video. Top 5 Wednesday was started by Lainey at Ginger Reads Lainey and I will link to her below. This week's topic is the top 5 books you wanted to start yesterday and these are in no particular order. Brandon Sanderson's The Well of Ascension because I won to participate in the Year of Cosmere and I did fantastic with the first book, Mistborn, but I still haven't started this. I even bought it, even though I don't like these covers. I got it, and I really enjoyed the first one. I just don't know why I haven't started reading it yet. Next is Richard Ford's Independence Day. I have had this on my shelf forever, and in my mind, I've wanted to read it forever. It's a Pulitzer Prize winner, and for whatever reason, I just have not read a single page. Like, I'm not even sure what it's about. So I don't know. I don't know why I want to read this book, and I don't know why I haven't just read it. Next is Philada by Andre Brink. This is a Man Booker Prize finalist. It is absolutely gorgeous. This showed up on my doorstep one day. It was on my Amazon wish list, and my husband got it for me. It's a nice cover. It has inside flaps, and it has the deckled pages. And it's just beautiful. It's about a slave girl in South Africa, I believe. And, yep, 1832 in South Africa, the year before slavery is abolished. So it's about what happens to her when slavery is abolished. And it's about slavery in another country. And it's not very long, so I don't know why I haven't just picked it up and read it. Next we have East of Eden by John Steinbeck. Now I love Steinbeck's writing. I greatly, greatly loved, adored The Grapes of Wrath, which is as big as this. So why haven't I read this? I have wanted to read it ever since I read Grapes of Wrath almost a year ago. And I still have not picked it up. I think it's the size, but that should not be a big deal for me. I don't understand. I just need to read it. I have to read it. And this is a nice penguin edition. I got it used. You can tell it's used. But it's a nice edition. And I just need to read it. I love Steinbeck's writing. Last but not least, we have S by J.J. Abrams and Doug Dorst, which I have had since it came out like around two Christmases ago and I still have not read it. I really want to. I'm just intimidated by it. Ooh, shoot. See? See what happens? Shoot. This is two stories. It's a fictional story and then there's a whole other fictional story written in the margins. Figuring out what happened to V.M. Straka. And there's lots of stuff inside of it. I have to pick that up. I have to pick it up. It's a postcard from Brazil. With the address marked out. Ooh, mystery. So, yeah, I just need to read it. There's a whole, like, newspaper. It's so cool. Oh, it smells so good. It's such an awesome book. It's like a library book. I just need to read it. It just intimidates me. And it has this gorgeous slip cover. So those are my top five books that I wish I had started reading yesterday. I really need to pick one of these and just make myself start. It's not that I don't like the idea of any of these books. I just don't know why I don't read them. I don't know. If you do this tag, let me know so I can check out your video and let me know what book you wish you had started yesterday. I will talk to you later. Bye.